Gyan at Timurandas Yaganandana Shlakaya Chakshun Tam Dina Tasma Shri Gurvain Maha Shri Chaitanya Manovistam Stapitam Jaina Bhutale Swayam Rupa Kadamayam Tadati Swapadantikam Vandeham Shri Guru Shri Yuta Padakama Shri Guru Vaishnavanshta Shri Rupam Sagajatam Sagana Ragnatam Vitam Tam Sajivam Sadvaitam Savadutam Parijana Saitam Krishna Chaitanya Devam Shri Radha Krishna Padasa Hakana Lalita Shri Vishakavitamsha. He Krishna Karuna Sindhu Dina Vandu Jagapate Gopesha Gopika Kanta Radha Kantamsha. Tapta Kanchana Gorangi Radhe Vindavanisri. Vishabhana Sudeva Brahma. Namon Vishnu Padaya Krishna Pastar Buddha Shamate Gorgovan Sona. First, before speaking, I'd like to offer my humble obeisances to the holy lotus feet of my divine Diksha Guru, Srila Guru Gavinaswami. Also, I'd like to offer my humble obeisances unto the lotus feet of my divine Param Guru, Srila A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada. And also, I'd like to offer my obeisances unto the holy lotus feet of my divine Shiksha Guru, Srila Bhaktivedanta Nari Maharaj. Um, you have to excuse me, I've been outside putting up a tent feverishly, trying to More get it. I've been outside putting up a tent, so I'm kind of sweating and a little bit um, out of breath. So, just following in the um, same kind of line of thinking of Devindranath Prabhu and um, Maharaj, um, in Chaitanya Chaitanrita, is stated Chiradadattam Nija Gupta Vitam Swaprema Namam Ritam Achudara Apamaram Yo Vitatara Gora Krishna Janipayas Tamaham Prabhadi that Chiradadattam Nija Gupta Vitam that for a long time Krishna he has not bestowed upon the fallen conditioned souls of this material world this is Vraja Prem that he comes in the different um, ages and is giving um, love of God. But such love is, is tinged with this um, mood of Aishvarya, Aishvarya Gyan. And Krishna, he comes once in the day of Lord Brahma and he teaches, he speaks through the Bhagavad Gita. And he explains Savam Dhamma Prichaja Mamikam Sharanam Vaja. Also, he explains Manmana Bhava Mad Bhaktu Madhiji Mamdamas Guru. That we should surrender unto him. We should abandon all varieties of religion, all conceptions, designations, upadis. And ultimately, that we should always think of him, worship him um, in love. But Krishna explains in the Gita. But after Krishna winds up his lila and he goes to Golok, he's thinking that for residents of this um, planet to understand this in tattva and truth, it's very, very difficult. So I have to come again. So he comes um, as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And when Mahaprabhu comes, then that verse, Chiradadattam nejagupta vitam Swaprema namamrita matyudara Apamaram yo vitatara gora Krishna janebya stamaham prabhadye That he gives Swaprema swap, uh, namritam He gives um, his, ho- his own prem through the holy name Prem nam sankirtan uh, Maharaj he quoted the verse Goloka prema dan hari nam sankirtan So Mahaprabhu is giving his own prem through chanting Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. But it's just not Nam Sankirtan, but it's Prem Nam Sankirtan. It's imbued with the mood of the residents of Vrindavan, the bridge Basis. And specifically, it's imbued with the mood of the gopis, most specifically Srimati Radharani. Apamaram yo vitataru gora. That He's um, so munificent that he's given it to the Apamras, to one and all, not just those who may come from um, Brahmin families or, or who have so many qualifications, but Apamara. Apamara means he's given to the lowest, even. Um, Apamara myo vitataragora, 
Krishna Janibya Stamahampabhati. So to that Lord Krishna, we pay our obeisances. So Mahaprabhu, he comes, and he's giving the holy name, imbued with this um, Vraj Bhakti, Vraj Prem. And he departs, but falling from him are his very intimate associates. Um, the Vindanath Prabhu was explaining, such intimate associates, they are Gora Priyajanas. They're very dear to Mahaprabhu. And also, they're Radha Priyasakis, the intimate associates of Srimati Radharani. And they are always on the earth, traveling and benedicting the fallen conditioned souls. Um, not just with Nam Sankirtan, but with Prem Nam Sankirtan. Rupa Goswami, Sanat Goswami, Six Goswamis, um, Narottam Das Thakur, Vishnu Chakravati Thakur, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Prabhupada, Srila A.C. Bhakti Danta Swami Prabhupada. So these um, persons, they're intimate associates of Mahaprabhu, and they have this Vraj Prem. And in the mood of Mahaprabhu, they're going and they're giving the holy name, and internally also they're tasting. So, I also, I'm feeling very, very fortunate because um, first coming in contact with um, spiritual life through ISKCON, um, I joined in 78, Srila Prabhupada had left the planet on 70, in 77, so I never met Srila Prabhupada physically. And, um, I was initiated first by Jai Titha, and he fell down, then by Bhagavan, he fell down. And then I was very fortunate to come in contact with um, very, re very great Mahabhagwat, His Holiness Srila Guru Govinda Swami. And I got a um, little taste of what it is to come in contact with such rare personalities who carry this mood. Where they go, then this atmosphere is there. Even if one is very, very thick, still just in their presence, this special atmosphere, which is carried by Rasika Bhaktas, it permeates. And where they go, a festival is there. So when I came, I just told Chaitanya Chandra, don't worry. Good day's coming. Everything's gonna, it's just gonna happen. Because wherever they go, they have Krishna and Everything just happens very, very nicely, very, very sweetly. It's stated, Krishna se toma, Krishna dite paro, toma sakati ache. Amito kangala, Krishna, Krishna boli, daitava pache pache. That such Vaishnavas, they have Krishna within their heart, Krishna se toma, and they can give and they're giving Krishna, Krishna Ditepa. Toma Sakityachi Amito Kangala. So, we who do not have Krishna, but we aspire to serve Srimati Radharani and Krishna, then we just follow such Vaishnavas to do whatever service as beggars and just begging, please give me Krishna, give me Krishna, give me Krishna, give me Krishna. So, somehow, I don't know how, but actually I know how, just by the mercy of my spiritual master, my Diksha Guru, Gaur Govinda Swami, I am able to um, take, to whatever limited degree I'm able, the association of Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Maharaj. And I am feeling so fortunate and so happy that somehow I'm able to be in this situation. Actually, I'm a blind person. I don't know who's who. But within my heart, I just feel so safe in his association. I do not know philosophy, I don't know anything. But I just know that what he says, I can follow and it's right. I may not know what it is, what it's not. I try to know, but I'm so limited. What can I know? So, this is the mercy of my spiritual master, that he has directed me in this way to the um, very safe, very soothing, um, very sweet lotus feet of um, Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Maharaj. And we see that he's so merciful that just before coming, 
in India, there was talk of operation, hard operation, um, so many things. And then finally, it was decided, no, it's okay, he doesn't have to have the hard operation. Then in Delhi, they arranged some programs, and they take him all over Delhi. And he's so obliging that he doesn't say no, and he just goes. And when different devotees want him here and there, and he goes and he speaks. But then he came down with pneumonia two days before. And then the doctor said, OK, it's all right to travel. And now, such late age, such physical, such, so many impediments, he's coming and just giving. And heart is so soft, but determination is so strong that Guru Deva said that he will keep on coming till his last breath. How fortunate we are. That he has so much, and he's just coming to give. One time in England, he said um, that Swamiji, he has ordered me. So whether they like it or not, <laughs> then I will take the medicine and I will force it in their mouth. <laughs> Srila Bhakti Dantanaraya Maharaj Ki. So this is Sadhu Vaidya, transcendental physician. He knows just how much to give, to give to whom, how, where, every situation. So in his association, we don't have to worry about a thing. There's a song, you don't have to worry about a thing. With Gurudev, you don't have to worry about a thing. Just sit down, just take it in, enjoy serve, and in this way we can please our Guru Devs, and we can please Srila Prabhupada and the um, Disciplic Succession, which says that the first one place I heard, maybe it was in Prabhupada's book, says Acharya, something like Rakshanam, that the first duty of the Acharya is to protect the Sampradaya. So, the Guru Dev is coming, and he's protecting the Sampradaya by, by um, re-establishing proper spiritual principles, re-establishing proper siddhanta. And sometimes we may not want to take, but he is so kind that he's just forcing it in, forcing it in. But it's so sweet that once come, one day, two day, three day, four day, that's it, finish. <laughs> just like they say, if you go to bank with Vamsivat, and come in contact with that blue boy with his Tri Bangalita root playing the flute, then you'll forget family, society, friendship, and love. So you come and you hear the sweet Harikata coming from the lips of Srila Gurudev, then Krishna in that form. Then after that, then come mad and just follow the traveling roadshow, the transcendental <laughs> roadshow. So I have, I um, guess I could say more, but I don't think there's any need. But um, I'm just very, very um, fortunate and grateful. And I just pray to Vaishnavas to please help me, pray for me that I can be an instrument for my Guru Maharaj, um, Srila Guru Govinda Maharaj, um, by being an instrument for Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Maharaj in um, purifying my heart and to whatever degree I can do to help others. Thank you.